Well, it's not hot today. It is cold out there. A second day where we're going to have significant wind chills out there. And uh, the good news, though, winds are going to improve by this afternoon. So that's where I'm starting off. Very cold with wind chills. Gusty winds are going to improve. Now, plenty of sunshine. Don't be fooled by it. Dress appropriately. Layers work. Uh, we've got a cold start to the week into Monday. But then a warming trend will start to kick in by midweek. And we're going from the 30s to 60. I think that's kind of nice. I'm looking forward to that 60 degree day. That's going to be on Friday. So, uh, you know, but in the meantime, it is cold. 23 degrees right now with the sunshine, but it feels like it's only 11 in the district. And that's the kind of wind chill factors that we have. 19 at Cumberland, the same at Martinsburg and Winchester. 15 at Culpeper this hour. 26 at Annapolis and 21 at Leonardtown. Winds gusting from the northwest. Could gust up to 25 miles an hour today before they start to diminish. Right now, 20 23 mile per hour winds in the district, 22 at Winchester. But here's what it feels like if you're going to step outside this hour. Only four at Gaithersburg, seven at Dulles. Feels like six at Martinsburg, five at Winchester, and eight at Westminster. So oh, that's telling. So as we get into the day, we're going to see those winds get pretty gusty. As I said, the potential up to 25 miles an hour. Here we are at the 11 o'clock hour, 24 mile per hour wind gust at Gaithersburg. By 12.30, 24 at Martinsburg, 22 at Baltimore. They start to improve, you can see, as we get into the afternoon hours. And here we are at 6 o'clock at night, only 8 miles per hour hour in the district so that's not bad eight o'clock at night 12 at Manassas and the wind chill factor same story we're going to see some improvement by 11 it'll feel like 10 at Gaithersburg 7 at Cumberland 12 at Frederick and then as we progress into the day 13 in the district by 1230 and then by 230 this afternoon you can see the wind chill factor gets a little bit closer to the north and I mean higher to the temperature range but then into Monday morning when you're stepping out and the young ones are getting ready to go to school it's going to feel like it's one only at 9 a.m. and four at Gaithersburg so that improves also by the time we get to about midday. Tonight's a cold one also. Here's your overnight lows, only 9 at Martinsburg, 15 degrees in the city. But that warmer air is on the way. We're going to see it push in as we get closer to about midweek. And then we're going to see the temperature rise. At the end of the week, we'll be near 60. But with all this, we've got some rain to talk about. Here's one of our models. Looks like it's going to start to move in on Wednesday. Here we are Wednesday morning about 11 o'clock and moves up the I-95 corridor. Fills all in throughout the day. Thursday, same story. Here's your morning commute at 8 o'clock. Plenty of rainfall. Takes us through into Thursday night. Gets a little heavier, though, into Friday. Here's midday. And then as we get into Saturday, it starts to pull out with a few lingering showers. So keep all that in mind. Here's that seven-day forecast. Happy to say 60 degrees by Friday. But be safe out there in the cold weather and the rain coming up. Tom?